Good morning, it is Sunday and I had a lie-in this morning, didn't get up until about quarter to nine, so I'm feeling like I'm in my second night's worth of sleep, I feel a little bit hungover because I don't normally have that much sleep, but yeah, I've got up and I'm just watching my favourite knitting, well one of my favourite knitting podcasters, and we're trying to decide what we're going to do with our day, we're definitely going to try and put a bit of time aside to do the shed that we didn't do yesterday, but I think we're just going to do it in like segments. So we're going to set ourselves like an hour to do a bit today. And then we'll set another hour another day. And we're just going to do it like that rather than trying to do a whole day of sorting the shed. Because although you get it over and done with, it just means you lose the whole day just to doing something that's not particularly fun. So I think that's the plan. Um, there is a the craft market things on at Elveston again today. And I did think about going back because I want to get a floral like tribute for my dad's grave for Christmas but I think there's actually another market on the start of December so I'm not sure whether to go to the December one or not I mean it will be artificial I think anyway so it's not gonna make any difference but I don't really want to put it on too early and I don't want to have to store it so I might wait till the December one I'm not sure yet so we're just trying to decide what we're going to do with our day I do know that that if you had depends on how humans feel and he wants to look to Corey's later with me because he wants to look at a new PC set up for his bedroom and like monitors and things so we'll probably be doing that at some point and i need to get something for dinner because i've not got anything for dinner today so yeah i'm not sure what the plan is yet but i shall keep you posted Pardon? It wasn't as fun. True. Mm. Okay, Luna. Good girl. Come for a nice walk. Yeah. Well, I don't know if they all do. These are right fat ducks, these are. There you go. Don't worry about it, the other one. So we've come back to Elverston Castle and been to the, the craft market that was on again. Not quite as busy this time, there's a few missing tables, but we've secured two pies for our dinner. One's venison and red wine, and the other one is steak and ale. I think it's called beaver pie, <laughs> which I think Ed was disappointed when he found out what's actually in it. But it's really busy, so I haven't been able to vlog very much because there's kids everywhere, and obviously I don't want to vlog other people's children. So, just heading out. We didn't stay for anything to eat or a coffee because there was a massive queue, and last time it took ages. We have also bought some scones, so. That is not going well at the moment. So we just went past a couple who had a dog called Kevin, which was very playful and very funny, but it did entertain me the fact the dog was called Kevin. But it's actually quiet on this part that we're on now. So we're just going to give Luna a nice walk because she spent most of the night hiding last night because the fireworks were so bad. And I should imagine for the next few days it'll carry on. We're away next weekend, so I'm hoping where we're going it won't be that bad because we're quite kind of in the middle of nowhere. So that should be better. I think we ought to bear in mind, Eddie, perhaps we should think this time next year that we should perhaps go away for the duration of like bonfire night to my birthday. Book, book a cottage somewhere that's really quiet. Mm. Make sure we've saved like a week or so's holiday back. Something to think about. We did give her a tablet last night in the end. Had a real job getting it down though. But yeah, as I was saying, the craft market was good, but a lot of the same stuff that you see at a lot of them, which are like, not, very well done. not particularly well done. I couldn't vlog in there because it was just busy and I couldn't really get my camera out. And my little camera, I've got no battery on. I'm still learning how to use it and I'm not very, uh, it's still easier to just whip my camera out of my, on my uh, iPhone. Anyway, enough talking. I'm gonna go.
We're back from Elveston and I'm going to have a spoon. So Eddie and I are going halves. I'll quickly show you. I haven't had anything to eat today. So this is the first thing I'm eating and it's 10 to 1. So this is half a, I think it's Christmas pudding fudge and cheese scone. We've both got one. So quite a lot of butter on there. <laughs> but hopefully it'll be tasty and it will fill me up till I do my dinner. You can't, you're right. No, you will. Pressure washer so that I can actually clean it properly. Well, it's 20 past six, and I still haven't edited my video because I just sat down to edit and then Chloe and Ethan arrived. So they arrived, they brought me actually. I'll just quickly show you what they brought. So I have paid for it. They've actually brought Luna a little present round, which is this. Which she wasn't bothered about. I think it's because of the fireworks. But they also managed to get me an advent candle for Vlogmas and a base for it. So that's very exciting. Oh, I've got itchy nose. I'm going to sneeze. So she came and that, obviously, like, I didn't get my edit done. And I just sat down to edit again. And Ewan came down to look at computers. And I was like, kind of just edit my video first. But he st stayed down, which obviously I stopped editing because I don't really like to sit editing in front of people. So dinner's ready now. So I'm going to dish dinner. And then when I'm eating, I'm going to sit and get my edit done. Here's my dinner. So I've got a small piece of pie. I've got mashed potato made with skim milk. I've got some broccoli that's been done in the air fryer and some roast carrots. So this is dinner. Well, I shall catch you later. Still desperately trying to edit my video, but I keep getting interrupted by people. So I'm going to quickly scoff my dinner and then hopefully get it done. So hopefully you will see it at some point today. Well, it would have been yesterday for you. Anyway, I shall catch you tomorrow for another video.